Hey everybody, welcome to today's Daily Video Devo. I'm joining you here with Valerie, and uh, we are in the control room in the auditorium at Twin Lakes Church. This is where all the live stream stuff happens. It's so cool. Jamie Rahm's normally our director up here. She's holding the camera right now. But I decided to film this here because this kind of represents kind of the control center of what goes on in the auditorium and the weekend services. And I want to tell you what's going to happen over the next uh, four weeks in the weekend services here at Twin Lakes Church. Why? Because I'm starting my sabbatical, and that means we have amazing things planned for the next several weekends. Don't miss a single thing. For example, this weekend is Mother's Day, and Val, what do we have going on on Mother's Day? Well, on Mother's Day, as usual, we've got our baby dedications, which are always so fun, and then we have a special gift for all moms. So moms, you especially want to join us this weekend. That's right. A special gift. It could be a $100 Amazon gift card. Probably be. not, but it could be. So I hope you come and get your special gift. What do they call it in a Christmas story? The very special gift. Well, you guys know what I'm talking about. That's what moms can get. And then the next weekend, the next weekend. is very exciting Ooh. because it's Hamilton weekend. It's Hamilton it. weekend. What's on Friday night? All right. Friday night, we've got Bethany Hamilton here. Soul Surfer. Amazing story. You can get tickets at BethanyHamiltonLive.com. And then Saturday and Sunday, Herman Hamilton is going to begin a three-week series. You won't want to miss it. Plus, it's cookie weekend, as wow. if that wasn't enough. So it's Bethany Hamilton. Herman Hamilton, and then we're going to be showing Cookies. the musical Hamilton that same exact weekend. That's actually not true, but there's so much stuff going on and many, many more things going on all summer long. You know, whether Renee or some other pastor is here or not, we can all still do what the Bible says a good church does in Acts chapter 2. This is one of my favorite verses. This is what made the early church so vibrant, starting in verse 42. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and to fellowship, to the breaking of bread and to prayer. All the believers were together, had everything in common. They sold property and possession to give to those who had need. Every day they continued to meet in the temple courts. They broke bread in their homes, ate together with glad and sincere hearts, praising God and enjoying the favor of all the people and the Lord added to their number daily those who were being saved. That verse is going to happen here at Twin Lakes Church this summer, and I am stoked to come back after my sabbatical and hear all about it. Yeah. God bless you guys. I hope you come this weekend to Mother's Day, and then Hamilton weekend the next, and all the other good stuff this summer. Have a great week.